So here we are in Santiago del Tain, in front of us we got the National Road, we're going to take to the right, the road is going to be better now, wider, everything is over, come on, give a big applause to our driver. Yeah, you see the statue, it represents one of the first inhabitants of Tenerife, the ranches, since the big sign of the statue, the the statue, the statue, the statue, the statue, Okay, now we turn to the left, going across that little village of Old, it's called Las Manchas, the spots in English, because at the beginning of every year, there are plenty of almond trees. Look at the tail, the snow above, see the blue sky, and also Pico Viejo, the one that we saw today with the last eruption of 1798. We're going to pass by the place where the last eruption, Tenerife, took place. It was at 1909, Volcano Chiniero. And that particular village is called Las Manchas, the spots, because at the beginning of each year, all the trees that you go around, most of them, they are almond um, trees. And at the beginning of each year, they got a beautiful pink and white color. Therefore, they call it the spots, because of this beautiful color contrast between the black color lava and the pink and white blossom from the trees. Okay, Fabio jetzt Richtung Gia di Sora, da kann man diese Euphorie kaufen. Und bevor, da fahren wir durch so kleine Ortschaften, da heißt Las Manchas, die Flecke auf Deutsch. Und hier blüten die Mandelbäume im Januar. Sehr schön weiß und rosa Farben. Und da fahren wir vorbei, weil die Uvarest, die Uvareste von der letzten Vulkan ist auch unter Belief, also 1909, Vulkan Chiniero, wenn wir das gleiche nicht weiter hochziehen. 
Marco Di Vedetti. Un altro paesaggio. Look how quick it changed everything. See it now, look at everything with the black color lava with all the plants growing up on top of the lava with all those figs and almond trees with the little white marguerites and the yellow color blossom of this beautiful tinius. Away to Via de Sora. They are at Via de Sora, we have been uh, asked several times before when we were in Masca and I can show you that we're going to stop in Via de Sora. Don't worry about it because there you will find this funny that I was talking about this morning while we were in the crater. And also uh, for the customers, they are suffering so much for the turns, you are all invited to try the banana cream and the rum honey. It's going to pick you up. Ok, ecco questo villaggio che vediamo di fronte si chiama Las Manchas de Macchie, italiano, perché quando fioriscono questi mandorli, vedete, fioriscono all'inizio di gennaio, bianco e rosa. E sono dei contrasti bellissimi tra il bianco e rosa dei, dei mandorli con lo scuro, la tinta oscura, nera, bruna della lava. Molto bello qui il gennaio. Beautiful here with all the almond trees that are close. That's how sure here we can get the rubbish. France, the maximum of lava, 12, Mandel, Feigen, Feigen, Campin. That's all this in January. Got the broom, not the day the broom, another type, but the bit of brush on down, the whites. Let me see if I can see the ginsta, not the day the sun, but the normal ginsta, the white sun. Got the back of the ginestra, the fiorice of the alberi. And everything grows up on top of the lava stones. You see, see? Everything. Yeah, well, all this big stuff in lava stone. But we get my bell look to the pitch of the roccia volcanica. Okay, and there are now you can see the rest of the eruption in 1909. You can see the rest in 1909. Ecco, tutta questa lava, volcanica, la lanno 1909. So you remember I told you about this uh, volcanic eruption, you see the rest, all the trees that you see there that have been planted after the eruption obviously, you see all the black lava, they come from the volcano above, 
men destroyed parts of his village down there at Aguayo. So when that happened in 1909, a lot of families from Aguayo went to America as emigrants. And the little village was almost empty because it was everything was destroyed by the lava. So you see above there on the left inside the, the little stone walls, they do it just in between the lava. You see the lava came down, but there it was safe. But it was not, obviously it was not enough. So a lot of people emigrated to America. From all the little villages of Tenerife, most people they went to America were from this little village from Aguayo. First of all to Cuba, and then after the arrival of Castro, they moved to Venezuela. We are great something in Ocha, that is Aguayo, that is in fin, a lot of Aguayo as emigrant to America, and the volcanic outflow from the whole world, so we don't know if the Grana Ocha was going to start. Jetzt sind aber wieder zurückgekommen, haben sich neue Häuser aufgebaut, aber dann sind die Lava wogen vor. Bis dahin ist da hinten gegangen. Wir sind die Lava, die Cessa, der Vulcano, sotto, fin al Villaggio, es ist tutto parte di questo Villaggio, con molta gente partita all'estero. Die Migranti, perché ecco, tutte le terrazze, tutto è stato distrutto per la Lava. Sono molta gente di Arguaglio, sono andata prima a Cuba e dopo Venezuela, ora tutti i resti dell'eruzione, dappertutto dove guardate ecco c'è la rama. We find the sunshine again, so you want to see now the coast, all the coast from Tamaimo, there's the name of that village down there, you see this, and they're all along the Playa de las Americas. You find the sunshine once again, so here, yeah, I'm seeing the Vida, it's kind of vacant from all las Americas. Casa Cristo, Davanti, Abadina, Autobahn, they're building the new motorway now. The day that we're ready, we could be able to do the whole island tour, the highway. Okay, I'm seeing how it is in the mountain, the autobahn, the Aesthetic Gebauke, the Pemantin Kanze, each other on fat, autobahn, power. I can read it in Sol, in Andra Volta, I'm arriving to the end of the day, we're going to go to the next and the last one, before we arrive to the next one. So it's ten reef, you know, with a lot of contrast. Not only landscape, it's also the weather changed so quick. But when we were in Masca, it was raining a little bit. Look at that now, not far away. There's always sunshine. Of course, we have to move to one place to another, but we don't have to do so many kilometers to find totally different landscapes and totally different kind of weather. So you see, now how many of you kilometers far, now my grade in Masca, rain you have, it's a manzone vida. Vedete che il tempo cambia molto, abbiamo lasciato maschera dietro, pioveva un pochettino, qualche goccio di pioggia e adesso guardate che troviamo un bel tempo.